Unknown to these uh, passers-by, Peter uh, is an actor. Uh, As part of an experiment on bystander uh, apathy, he's pretending uh, to be ill. Help. Help. Uh, How long before he gets help? Helping would be inconvenient or even risky. He lies there for more than 20 minutes and no one raises an eyebrow. Another actor takes Peter's place. How long before she receives help? Four minutes later and 34 people have passed without stopping. Well, people don't really want to know that they just haven't got the time. Well, they have got the time, they just don't want to get involved. Unwittingly, these strangers have silently formed a temporary group with a rule, don't get involved. They're afraid to stand out from the crowd and won't take action if no one else does. This woman has clearly spotted Ruth, but she conforms to the rule and does nothing. Watch what happens, though, when someone else helps. You all right? You all right? Yes, thank you. Sure, you look a bit clicky, you know what I mean? She suddenly oh, finds sure. herself in a different group with a new rule to help. Uh, you want to shut up? She don't look well, does she? Uh, you all right? Yeah. What's wrong? First I thought she was dead. Then I saw the check to see if she was breathing or not. And I looked around and I couldn't believe that no one had noticed her because there was a bloke sat there just absorbed in reading a newspaper. This time, Peter's dressed as a respectable gentleman. Now that his dress is in keeping with those around him, how long before he's rescued? Hello, sir. How are you today? I'm all right. Six actually. seconds. <laughs> she even call? calls him <laughs> sir, and suddenly no, everyone's fine. a good Samaritan. Do you suffer from epilepsy? No. Why you're lying on the floor in the rain? Because he's part of the right group.